Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. RHOC's Shannon Beagle reacts to Alexis Bellino's manipulative olive branch. I don't like you. Shannon Beter has finally found her voice this season, and she's not letting Alexis Bellino get away with dragging her anymore. The Real Housewives of Orange County star called Checkmate on her co-star on the latest episode as she announced that she was hosting a cast trip to London. Interestingly, after weeks of going after Shannon, the 47-year-old suddenly decided she wanted to call a truce. She made a grand gesture by sending her a bouquet with a literal olive branch included, as the other women gathered to celebrate Shannon's 60th birthday. However, Shannon recently reacted to the olive branch and reasoned it was a manipulative move on Alexa's part. That's also been the reaction from viewers as they noted the convenient timing of the gesture. Shannon was about to announce the cast trip, and Alexis was seemingly trying to make peace so she could snag an invitation but her efforts fell flat. Art Ho sees Shannon Bedor has a message for Alexis Bellano. I don't like you. Shannon had just found out that John Jansen was forging ahead with a lawsuit against her, and she discovered that after the couple gave the information to the press. So Alexis' attempt to make peace could not have come at a worse time. The RHOC star opened up about the moment while chatting with Bravo, and she had some choice words for her co-star. Noting, I'm not interested in an olive branch, I'm not. Once again, it was so much manipulation behind it. Do you think that I don't have anything going on in here, said Shannon pointing at her head. She continued, you know that a trip's coming up and that I don't, I don't like you. So, let's send her some flowers with an olive branch and be super cute. Heather Debrow says the timing of Alexa's olive branch felt suspect. Heather Debrow, who's close friends with Alexis, also commented on Alexis' gesture to Shannon and reasoned that it was a nice thing to do. However, she also confessed that the timing of the olive branch felt suspect to Shannon because of the lawsuits. Meanwhile, Heather is not taking sides between the two women, admitting that being friends with them has not been easy and that they have both. I'm not sure either of them are handling it the way they should, but I don't blame them, added the RHOC star. I don't know, it's a really hard place to be. Check out the RHOC cast commentary below. In the world of reality television, alliances shift faster than the tides and friendships can disintegrate quicker than a glass of champagne hitting the floor at a dramatic dinner party. The Real Housewives franchise has mastered the art of capturing these intricate dynamics, particularly on the long-running Real Housewives of Orange County. RHOC Recently, RHOC has been a cauldron of drama, with Shannon Beter at its center, facing yet another challenge in the form of former castmate Alexis Bellino. What began as an olive branch extended by Alexis has spiraled into a public confrontation filled with suspicion, manipulation, and bitter feelings that culminated in Shannon delivering a blunt response. I don't like you. The history between Shannon and Alexis before delving into the fallout from the recent Olive Branch attempt, it's essential to understand the strained history between Shannon Bedor and Alexis Bellino. Their time together on RHOC was far from cordial. During the years they spent together on the show, tensions simmered as their personalities clashed. Shannon, known for her outspoken attitude and no-nonsense approach to friendships, often found herself at odds with Alexis, whose religious values and perceived perfectionism rubbed many of the other housewives the wrong way. While their drama didn't reach the explosive levels of some of the more iconic feuds in the franchise, such as Tamara Judge vs. Vicky Gunbolson, or Teresa Judas vs. Danielle Staub, Shannon, and Alexis always had an undercurrent of tension. Alexis, who often played the role of the damsel in distress, tried to paint Shannon as a bully, while Shannon saw Alexis as someone who was inauthentic and manipulative, always trying to paint herself as a victim. After Alexis left the show, the two women rarely spoke about each other publicly, but the bad blood between them never seemed to dissipate. So, when Alexis extended an olive branch recently, it seemed like a surprising turn of events, at least on the surface. Alexis Bellino's olive branch, sincere gesture or manipulation, 
In a world where scripted reality TV drama meets the unpredictability of real emotions, nothing is as simple as it seems. Alexa's olive branch toward Shannon was no exception. The former housewife, who left the show to focus on her family and other ventures, appeared to want to bury the hatchet and move forward in a positive direction. She publicly expressed her desire to reconcile with Shannon, suggesting that their past differences could be left behind in favor of a more mature, cordial relationship. However, for many longtime viewers of RHOC, Alexa's actions raise eyebrows. Was this gesture truly about making peace, or was there an ulterior motive at play? Alexis, who has been somewhat removed from the spotlight since her departure from RHOC, could easily be seen as trying to stir up attention and possibly angle for a comeback to the show. After all, reconciliation and redemption arcs had become somewhat of a staple in the Housewives universe. Could this olive branch be part of a larger scheme to get back on the radar of Bravo executives? Shannon Beter, who has never been one immense words, certainly seemed to think so. According to insiders, Shannon was skeptical of Alexis' sudden change of heart from the beginning. In private conversations with friends and other RHOC cast members, Shannon reportedly expressed doubt that Alexis was sincere. She saw Alexis' olive branch as a manipulation tactic, an attempt to gain favor and perhaps even create a storyline that could see Alexis reinsert herself into the franchise. Shannon's brutal response, I don't like you. As Alexis continued to reach out, Shannon's suspicions only grew. Things finally came to a head during a recent gathering of the housewives, where the tensions between the two women reached a boiling point. In typical housewives fashion, what was supposed to be a calm conversation quickly escalated into a heated exchange. Alexis, trying to explain her position and the reasons for extending the olive branch, was met with a stone-cold Shannon, who wasn't having any of it. According to witnesses, Shannon made it clear that she wasn't interested in rekindling any sort of friendship with Alexis. She didn't mince words or dance around the issue. Instead, Shannon delivered a blunt, cutting response that left no room for misinterpretation. I don't like you. For fans of RHOC, Shannon's reaction was both shocking and completely on brand. Shannon has built a reputation on the show for her honesty, no matter how harsh it may come across. Whether she's calling out her fellow housewives for their behavior or addressing her own personal issues in a raw and unfiltered way, Shannon has always been unapologetically herself. And in this case, she clearly wasn't going to pretend to be friends with someone she didn't trust or like the fallout. Fans and cast members weigh in. The fallout from Shannon's blunt rejection of Alexis's olive branch has sent shockwaves through the RHOC fan base and the cast itself. Social media has been buzzing with reactions from viewers, many of whom support Shannon's decision to be upfront about her feelings. Fans have pointed out that Shannon's honesty is one of the reasons they'd love her. She doesn't play games, and she doesn't fake friendships for the sake of appearances. Others, however, have expressed disappointment in Shannon's refusal to even entertain the possibility of reconciliation. They argue that everyone deserves a second chance and that Alexis may have been genuinely trying to make amends for past wrongs. In their eyes, Shannon's refusal to let bygones be bygones reflects poorly on her, suggesting that she may be holding on to grudges unnecessarily. Within the cast, opinions are similarly divided. Some of the housewives have reportedly sided with Shannon, echoing her sentiments that Alexa's olive branch was more about manipulation than genuine forgiveness. Others, however, have been more sympathetic toward Alexis, questioning whether Shannon's harsh response was warranted or if there was a better way to handle the situation. What's next for Shannon and Alexis?